This white-tailed spider is looking for an easy kill. She's checking out a rock ledge that happens to be a cellar spider's home. And the delicate homeowner will defend its territory to the death, no matter how huge the invader. The cellar spider starts a war dance. One of the things that cellar spiders do to avoid being attacked by predators is they swirl on their legs. Another thing that they might do is pump up and down, and they disappear because they're moving so fast they become invisible. The whitetail isn't so easily fooled. She holds her ground. Conflict is inevitable. For the whitetail spider, it's all about getting the first bite in. But the cellar spider moves first. It flicks the whitetail onto its web. The whitetail tries to regain its footing. But the cellar spider goes into silk spinning overdrive. From a safe distance, its legs lasso the whitetail six times every second. But the white tail is strong. She keeps breaking free. Cellar spider's silk isn't the strongest, nor stickiest in the spider world. But there's a lot of it. And every throw counts. Hundreds of silk ropes entangle the white tail. In a desperate last effort, she tries to slash her way to freedom with her huge fangs. The whitetail spider will use its fangs to cut through the silk. If it can get out, it'll run for its life. But the cellar spider counters, hoisting her victim higher. It's spinning too much silk and the whitetail's jaws may not be enough. Thousands of silk ropes finally immobilize the whitetail. Enough for the cellar spider to move in for the kill. It delivers its deadly payload and leaves the venom to do its work.